Hi guys and welcome to Retrobit. In today's episode we're going to be doing some homebrew gaming on the ZX Spectrum. Now I've been looking forward to this one guys because the, the game that we're playing today is called Saboteur. Saboteur was originally um, brought out on the ZX Spectrum and the Commodore 64 in uh, 1985. Um, I never played it on the Commodore 64 so this is a first time play for me. Um, the game was coded by a guy called Clive Townsend. Uh, and Clive Townsend has um, done another version of this. Well, he's re-encoded the intro and I think it's the high score table, especially for Bumfun Gaming. So, this actual game is in a four set. This was the game that was um, given to me by Brian Dickinson. Um, and yeah, you get four games on this. They sold a handful set for 20 quid, as you can see. It's really well set out, um, and uh, it's obviously a bit of a, a play on the, the They Sold a Million, um, which normally looks for something like that. So, um, we'll just take a quick look inside. And of course, we've got the media, the tape itself, which is here. Very nice, nice clear tape. Looking forward to giving that a go, guys. Um, and for every game, you do get an inlay card. Um, we will be paying a visit to the other three games as time goes on, but um, we're just going to be doing one game at a time, and that is the inlay for the Saboteur by Clive Townsend. So, looking forward to this one. Um, I have had a look at some of the screenshots and. Um, like the, the main character is like quite a largely drawn sprite um, you might just be able to see it there at the bottom guys um, so yeah this should be pretty good hoping it loads up on the uh, the plus 2B that I've got um, had a couple of issues compatibility issues for the first time um, in the last video for the ZX Spectrum so I'm hoping this one goes a little bit better so let's find out and get down to some gameplay Right guys, here we go, um, it loaded first time, um, always on the spectrum, you've normally got to uh, um, press stop on the on the tape if it's any sort of multi-load, where there have been two games on there, uh, one side, that's pretty much, uh, <laughs> glad I remembered, so press any key to continue. choose joystick and we're going to go for start mission skill level yeah we're going to go the easiest possible guys you see my gameplay <coughs> right let's do it so buttons gonna, uh, up is that down or what we're against the timer as well Right, okay, let's get growing. Oh, what's this here? Can I pick that up? No, I don't think so. Oh, nice jump there. Oh, shit. Oh, ouch. Get some. Okay, that dog. Good. <coughs> Never played this before, guys, on anything. Uh, there's no sound, but I do think this is a Spectrum 48 k Well, there was a bit of a bit of music at the beginning there. The game itself is very colourful. What 
was that there? Can I pick this stuff up? How do I pick this up? No. That's what I'm... Oh, right. Maybe it's because I'm still holding that. Shit. Oh, yes. Totally screwed over there. Is my health... Your health looks like it comes back sometimes. Can I... health doesn't seem to have come back this time so I sound a bit loaded there I am absolutely full of cold well, that's weird how you can is my health coming back oh yeah my health is coming back now or maybe it's like you go in the water do you go in the water to get your health back maybe is that what yeah it must be all right Oh, and of course, um, next door's decided to do some uh, to build a gazebo. <laughs> but to be fair, they have been doing it for about. Oh, it's got to be a few months now. Oh, he's really giving us some. There we go. Oh, and I've just chucked me bloody thing away. Oh, nightmare. What's that up there? Can I get that? Oh no, me. See, my health is gone. War's going up. It goes up sometimes, and then other times it doesn't. So I'm not really sure what the crack is with that. Let's wait until these fire that. Go on, fire your shot off. Right, let's get up here. It's uh, quite a bit of a maze looking at this. Oh, wow. Yeah, I love that. Get so. circles here guys oh, I do remember going down here I think it was on the other side a brick do I want a brick nah I don't think so oh hello what's this oh, wow so it looks like we're on some sort of underground train that's pretty cool loving the sound effects from next door as well really kind of them Out of a fire. Oh, there we go. Oh, look at that, guys. Just threw a grenade into his face. Trust me, that's not an easy thing to do. I ain't got a clue where I'm going at anything. This game looks absolutely massive. Um, maybe I should have kept him grenade for there. Oh, well. Oh, what's that? I don't pick that up again. Oh, yeah, I've got it. Completely by luck that I managed to uh oh, wait, dog. Oh, oh, oh. Get some. Can we get through that? No. I don't know what that is. Changes colour. Anyone any ideas? <laughs> oh, that fucking dog's back again. Oh piss off me, man. Fuck me. Okay, that's not good. Let's go along here. We've got 26 seconds left. And I've got absolutely no idea what I'm meant to be doing on any of this. Maybe, I don't think I was maybe meant to get on that train. Let's just get out of here. So, for the next uh, sound effects, guys, we've got a helicopter coming in. One of the great joys of living next to... Uh, oh, how do I get off here? Of uh, living next to a hospital is that we've got helicopters coming in and out all the time. It's fantastic. Bizarrely, it only ever seems to do. Uh, they only ever seem to come in and out when I'm making a video. But hey, right, that didn't seem to take as long. Let's just did I go that way before? Or did I go this way? Right, there's not there. But my health seems to go up faster on this screen. Oh, does it? No, I don't know. Right, absolutely no to be able sometimes there's stuff that you can pick up. Ah, maybe it's, you have to stop moving to get your health back. Well, I've only got six seconds to complete the game. Or whatever that timer runs on. So I ain't gonna do it. But graphically I think it's sound. Especially for um, 1985 when it was originally brought out. 
It's pretty colourful. Dogs are annoying, like. But then I always have been a cat person, so I can't really, can't really complain. Time out and the mission has been terminated. So, well, saying that, I am on extra easy. At least I didn't die. But I think that's, uh, I think that's quite a good little game, that. Excellent work. Oh, thank you. You are one of our ten best ninja saboteurs. Enter your name. Well, I'm going to have a bit of that. <laughs> if uh, my keyboard works, which it isn't. Yay. <laughs> so I'm now called Padau. Well done, Padau. So, guys, what did you think about Saboteur for the uh, for the ZX Spectrum? Um, I like the I like the big size of the the, the sprites that they use uh, in the game. Um, of course, I, I am a, a firm lover of music in games. Uh, they're a huge uh, part of my nostalgia for um, games that I used to play back in the day. So, yeah, a bit sad that there's no music. Um, but yeah, it's pretty colourful. It's a massive game. Um, not quite sure, like what exactly I'm supposed to be doing. Maybe um, I should take a couple of more minutes and read through the through the inlay. So uh, I shall be doing that before I continue. <laughs> so um, no, very nice game, and I'm looking forward to playing the other three games on here. Um, we have, and here we go with the pronunciation. Um, <laughs> Dead Flesh Boy, uh, Tourmaline, and Phaeton. So um, we'll be giving them uh, games a run out next time, guys. Uh, next will be a Commodore 64 homebrew game next week. Um, I know exactly the game that I've got in mind, and I'm really looking forward to playing it. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to get back to the Spectrum. Uh, really enjoying playing the Spectrum at the minute, and uh, yeah. It's, uh, I definitely feel like I missed out a little bit as a kid, just having my Commodore 64. Uh, I wish I could have had another one. Anyway, uh, sounds like another helicopter's coming in, guys, so I'm going to uh, finish here. And um, it's a beautiful day in Inverness, so I'm going to have a beer. So until next time, guys, goodbye.